Hello and welcome, here's what's coming up on Pride Today. Jonathan Groff and Ben Aldridge shine in the second trailer for Knock at the Cabin, we have a sneak peek. And the first five minutes of the Drag Race Season 15 premiere are here, we have a first look. And speaking of the new season, we have brand new interviews with twin competitors, Sugar and Spice. Hey everyone, I'm Ricky Cornish. Thanks for joining me as we take a look at stories making headlines. The second trailer for M. Night Shyamalan's upcoming movie, Knock at the Cabin, has us gagged. The upcoming apocalypse movie follows a gay couple played by Jonathan Groff and Ben Aldridge as they are taken captive by four armed strangers while vacationing in a cabin in the woods. The movie appears to be an edge of your seat thriller and a truly great gay family drama. It seems there's more to this cabin than we first thought. Knock at the Cabin opens February 3rd only in theaters. For more on this story, head to out Com. And get ready, squirrel friends. Drag Race is almost here. We're only a couple days away from RuPaul's Drag Race Season 15, and a first look video has been released. In the new clip, fans get to watch four queens making their entrances as the competition begins. And let's just say we've got a few contenders for trade of the season already. I'm just going to jump right into it. The amount of people who have said you are the trade of the season oh, since yesterday is crazy. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Um, I've always been told that I am a little bit masculine in and out of drag and i i'm really learning to be a little bit dainty and feminine here and there i don't know how it's working right now what's up bro how you doing <laughs> you can watch the first five minutes of rupaul's drag race season 15 on out.com and speaking of drag race fans are already gagging over twin competitors sugar and spice i recently chatted with the queens ahead of the new season let's take a look when you got the phone call and the producer said, girl, get in here. Did they call Sugar right after? And you were like, wait, you too? <laughs> yes, that's exactly how it happened. They said, girl, get in here. And they called Sugar and girl, get in here too. And we're just, you know, I mean, that's the thing. It's like twin drag queens. It's kind of like, a, I feel like we're like a rare spe species. Species, you know, it's just like, it's just kind of like, I mean, I'm sure there's others out there, but you know, we kind of share the same womb. So it's like, why not share the same season on the same show, right? I mean, is it pretty wild to say that you've already made Drag Race history? I mean, I feel like they're getting the headlines wrong. Like when, I feel like I need to make a PSA, public service announcement, is that what it's called? That we're yes. not twins. Like we're actually just friends. We're really just friends that look alike. It's kind of awkward. It's weird. I don't know. I don't know where everyone got the twin thing from. I don't know either. You're gonna have to call MTV, honey, because I think they're saying the same thing. <laughs> I know, I know. It's because of the girls. You know, they're fresh, plump, and new. <laughs> exactly. When you see that there are some people who have been following your journey for so long, and now so many more fans are gonna come along for the ride, like how humbling is it that you get to connect with so many people out there? You know, I just wanna apologize to the people that I've been here <laughs> through it all because Lord has been a journey. I'm like, oh wow, you, you held on tight, I guess, I don't know. Um, TikTok literally ended up becoming my full-time job by default. It's like, you know, you have this such like, well, maybe Drag Race isn't for me. Like, cause you know, I'm not really a, a flipper, dipper, you know, I'm not Miss Jax over here. Um, and you think those things, but then you're like, oh no, wait, drag can be, you can redefine anything in your life that suits you. And I think that's the amazing thing about Drag Race. We welcome all different walks of life. So it's fun. If I'm gonna be the social media queen, I'll be that social media queen. You know, <laughs> I wanna kind of like do what I do, but like do it, Crazier. You know, I'm reclaiming my title. I used to be like Sugar the Bimbo Whore, but now I'm Sugar the Prophet. <laughs> <laughs> my name is Ricky Cornish. Thanks for joining me on Pride today. Check us out on Advocate Channel, streaming daily on YouTube.